Look at them eyebrows, though. <laughs> Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution 2 Dominion Campaign Multiple. That's right. We have been given early access to sort of check out all of the new things. So this will be going over, or this video in particular, I think, should be the full multi campaign. Uh, maybe, I don't know. We'll find out. It depends how long it is. <laughs> <laughs> because there's supposed to be three islands, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll kind of see how we do on that. So, without further ado, let's get into it, shall we? Enter the new worldwide dinosaur economy and tackle the moral dilemmas within. Consult with Kyla Watts and others to establish brand new dinosaur facilities across the Mediterranean and carve your own path between the authorities and the underground. Spoiler warning, uh, it's Dominion. Oh, right then, let's go. Oh, wait, we turned the voices off, didn't we? Oh, God. No. <laughs> Here we go. Do we have? Dinosaurs now roam free. Hey, months. there we go. They must adapt if they are to survive. <laughs> I haven't been doing this for years. It's fine. <laughs> the world they find themselves in is evolving, unfamiliar, and dealing with change unlike anything it's faced before. Mm. To coexist, we have to accept that these animals share the same needs as us they want a costa or a starbucks continue without resolution opinions remain divided right humanity acts and does so with honest intentions <laughs> even as they look to protect the prehistoric wildlife thumbs in the eye ah, gotcha. <laughs> but deep in the shadows lurks something much darker opportunists oh. that buy and sell dinosaurs like they're any other commodity Restoring balance comes at a price, and sometimes you gotta trust others, whether you like it or not. Oh, Kayla, what? She was the uh, the moral compass there, down in the uh, down the Malta things. Oh, look, we got Grech, we got Italy, and I don't know what the island is up there. Is is that real? I feel like that might not be real. Oh, oh, my geography is terrible. We'll find out. <laughs> Look at that, would you? <laughs> Do you see what I see? You know, Opportunity! Land, which I will say is surprisingly cheap, by what the way. You what I see is opportunity. Yes. Now, opportunity only becomes an advantage when it's in the hands of people that know what they're doing. Hmm? Mm hmm Really? Do you know what you're doing? <laughs> Admittedly, we are still finding our feet, but... I think you're just going to have to trust us on this one. I know yeah, what I'm doing. that's something I'd say you have to earn around here. They don't just hand it out. We're paying Ooh. you for more than your flying skills, Ms. Watts. I trust you can deliver? <laughs> I always do. Always has been. <laughs> Give up that kind of vibe. Woohoo, look at us! In this amazing park. What it looks so like. This is what we're working with. Hey, it's Barry. Good to see you made it to Malta in one piece. Ooh. Now, I know it looks a little rough on the outside, but she's got good bones. This place is all about the potential. Gonna explode. <laughs> Always ready for a challenge. Tell me, where should we begin? We? Everywhere. <laughs> uh, my team will begin by repairing what is already in place. Ooh. It will provide a solid foundation to work from. Now, the arrival building is up and running, and I'm sure you can handle the rest. <laughs> so you're not helping them? What are you talking about? Huh? I just did. <laughs> I've worked with your type before. Damn. You don't like to get your hands dirty, right? <laughs> not if I can help it. When it comes to the dinos, arm's length is much more my style. What do we need to repair these buildings? Paleo medical facility, backup generator, and viewing gallery. So hello, are you excited? Look at all this new stuff. I can't wait. I think last time I did a DLC, I recorded it in the wrong aspect ratio. So hopefully this time, we're all good. Let's fix all the buildings. So we're going to see. Ooh. I'm Dr. Dilla. Yes, you are. Oh, oops, my bad. Oh, wait, I can't get out of here. Okay. What? <laughs> right, why are dinosaurs enclosed? So I need to stay on here? How do I enclose them? 
Do I put them in there? Oh, I've got a location I need to send them to. Oh, right. Okay, so what I probably should do is open that gate. If I, I'm wondering if I can keep that gate open? Unless there's a way to get it in. Let's have a look. Does it say? Oh, I think it's one of these where they'll just automatically go. Okay, so we're going to use the new thing from the last DLC. The summon. Yes. We want to do the send one, really. They're doing a sale on uh, veggie burgers over there. So that's highlighted the gate. Yes. Yes. So now I should be able to just get my binoculars and have a good old view. Although, how do I use binoculars? Uh, aim. Oh, ho, ho, look at them go. Stampeding little chickens. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to see Listrosaurus. This is going to be so good. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to do the campaign. We're going to showcase things. It's going to be a busy day, man. <laughs> it's going to be a very busy day. <laughs> but hopefully, I should be able to get everything to you. Look at them go. Wasn't this hard, was it, in Lost World? They made it look way harder. <laughs> <gasps> Seems like a no-brainer to me. Ooh. As long as uh, I don't have to do anything, right? Me. We just need your approval. Great. <laughs> Waste not, yeah. want not. We upgrade operations and cut down on paperwork. Boom. Sign me up. Uh, digitally, that is. Looks gorgeous, though. I can't wait to, like, showcase dinosaurs in this sort of terrain. And the water. I was, I was trying to see if I could get under... Uh, the water to see if we can make aquatic uh, creatures here. Core guest building. Construct an operation. Like, what's it? Well, I do. P is. Why is P not path? I thought they fixed that. Oh my god. Hey, I'm Kayla Watts. Uh, I guess we're pretty new to these parts, <laughs> Mr. Semben. Beavers. Sorry, Semben. Oh. I take it you know the area? <laughs> I'm a pilot. It's in my best interest to know everywhere and everyone. Who are you? What are you doing here? I can hook you up. You mean the exchange? <sighs> I don't get involved. I take your cargo from point A to point B. You pay me, and we both go our separate ways. That's the way I've always done it. I respect that. Your connections could be useful. Thank you. Don't mention it. <laughs> this is so strange. Really. <laughs> we got every sort of character from the movies in here. This is brilliant. The dinosaur exchange. So this is the, the big thing with this campaign, and maybe with the Challenge Islands when you do this as well. Uh, the dinosaur exchange because there's no longer digging up dinosaurs getting dna now there's this thing so some transactions will in influence trust with the authorities and the underground so i'm assuming the underground is the the cage and then the authorities is the wildlife okay and beware not all sellers are reliable listings are not as they appear oh ooh, that's good impossible. i like this also means dealing with ambiguity Morality and economics can Eggs. be a volatile mix. And since we are talking dinosaurs here, whatever lines oh. we're crossing are yes. hated at best. Give me! Or completely invisible. Well, I'm pretty sure they're there, yes. but uh, Wait, how many? I make it a habit to oh my god, there's eight of them. Need to. <laughs> well, right now, we need to see some dinosaurs. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh my god! What's going on? <laughs> oh yes, look at it! The feathered beauty! Had what we needed. That's one source you can rely upon. Oh, why is it its tethers are so massive? Oh, it's what lonely. Really after here is a level of comfort hmm? for the dinosaurs and the guests. Because uh, really, one influences the other. <laughs> That's solid thinking. A calm hey, look at its face! Looks like pink. No, no! Less awkward phone calls I have to make. Win win! <laughs> You're welcome. Right. Purchase complete! Aid of the Raptors! It's over Raptor James, you fool! Oh! So we got the main one that's the skin from Jurassic uh, World Dominion. But then there's other ones. Oh, these are the regular skins! Ooh! We should name all of these preciouses. Increase dinosaur visibility to uh, 100%. Okay. What have we got? We've got another one. Oh, wait. I was going to say, it's not visible? Is that just when it drops another one in? Because technically, everything is visible. That's probably just going to happen when they all get dropped in. Yeah. Ensure all dinosaurs have 90% comfort. Okay, so I'm assuming this Stiggy Moloch needs things. Because I've just dropped this in here and haven't. Oh, ground leaf! You can get all the ground leaf you want. 
Don't worry. Oh, it's a fine balance this is. Uh, yeah, perfect. Maintain guest comfort. Ooh, yeah. Wow. I very rarely care for this. <laughs> okay, so let's go and put some things in. Is there new things for this? Oh, let's team oh, up oh, what's on going this on? next objective. Ooh. You do the work, I'll take the credit. That's a win for us both. Keep your dinosaurs disease free, which gives us plus eight for uh, the regular the authorities. Increase the number of victories fights or victorious fights for dinosaurs or make purchases from the exchange. Uh, so the the hardest one, which is increase the number of victorious fights for a dinosaur, is really good. It also gives us lots of money. Uh, I mean, I'll, we'll go for that one. We don't have anything that fights. So, I mean, maybe, possibly, if the Stiggy Molochs fight, that counts. I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, we'll have that. We'll do some illegal cockfighting or something. God knows. Are you guys not comfortable? You're missing meat! I'm so sorry! Here's your meat. There you go. Right, so that's that one done. Uh, and maintain guest comfort. So, I think we have to open in order to do that? Oh, closed park. Oh, it is technically park. Oh, look at this. This is cool. So this is like the arrival point in Malta. I like the brick. Yes. Oh, it looks really cool. You know, just give us more stuff. I really hope they don't just all of a sudden decide, you know what? We're done with Jurassic World Evolution 2. Let's do something else. Because there's so much they could do. Just like put aesthetics in like you have with Planet Zoo. Just keep on going. Ooh, let's see what this shelter looks like, actually. I want to see. Let me see. Oh, nice. Kind of just looks like it would fit in with the regular aesthetic. Doesn't they specifically shout out shelter to me. The people, ah, oh, they really need the toilet. All right, let's see the toilet then. It's beautiful. <laughs> right, maintain guest comfort. We got 25%. Wow, that is terrible. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot. We could be getting stuff, right? <gasps> oh, Alistosaurus. Heck yeah. That's, ooh, do we go with that one? Or do we go with this one? You know what? We could do this. We could do this. How, how many? How many Lystrosauruses? Three in total. Or we could get this one, which gives us three in total as well. Sold by the authorities in the UK. And this one's sold by the underground. I could buy now. I could buy Lystrosauruses. I'm not going to make them fight, I swear. <laughs> fight! Yeah, Lystrosaurus. Look at you. Look at them eyebrows, though. <laughs> Oh, he's so adorable. Totes adorable. Go on then. In you get. I'm not going to make you fight with an overwrapped, I swear. <laughs> Contracts have refreshed. If you want to change. No, no, no. I got this. I got this. I got this. Right, so we need to see. Oh, God. It's so small. I can barely even see it. Uh, so what these guys should do now is avoid the water, uh, which is going to be interesting. So they need a little bit of ground leaf. Oh, uh, that, was, that was a lot of ground leaf. Okay, whatever this is. Yep. And that is them done. You don't really need for much. In fact, I don't think you need a cage this big, if we're going to be honest. Apparently, you're fine. Comfort is on 71%. What, what is your area do you need? Your population, you need... Ooh, you need... Okay, so I can't make you guys fight because you'll, you'll die and not be happy and maybe break out. So I'm probably going to have to get some... Get some other ones. Now, I do have three million. Um, we're getting my guest comfort up. But they're probably going to want stuff over here now. Amenities, they need some toilets. Don't know how. Just here, when people reach this viewing place, they really need the toilet. <laughs> However, I have now constructed a staff center. So we'll place that. Uh, uh. What? Oh, these decorations. Oh, I've completely forgot. We should have a look at those. Right, that'll do. Let's put you down here. Right, yeah, let's have a look at the decorations. Uh, there's a few bits and bobs here. Ooh, so you could put this next to a wall. <gasps> that's cool. I just wish there wasn't this, you know, where you can't, you know, the building constraint. And unfortunately, that's where mods really come into their own because you can put them anywhere. Because if I had just a wall, yeah, you could kind of do that, sort of. Yeah. Don't know why, but there you are. Right, so Lystrosauruses are all good. I kind of just want to look at these guys for a second. Hello, look at you cuties. I mean, we will have like a whole showcase video on these guys. So if we don't see them too much here, uh, there will be a, a separate video showcasing all of them. Right now that we got staff building. Yeah, look at her with logistics. You cost so much, but you'll do. Because now 
I can get my guest satisfaction up, baby. Yes. It's a shame I haven't locked any nice roads because it goes from luxurious to crap. Oh, this looks gorgeous, though. Oh, look at it. It's beautiful. Oh, my God. Are we actually making money? How on earth is that happening? Right, you know what? We'll we'll buy these now. And we'll place them in the other Lystra souls. Because I, I, maybe there's like so many that they can deal with. But I know for a fact that they're pretty happy uh, with four being the minimum. So if I just keep putting in more, this is brilliant. I don't have to wait for a hatch. I don't have to choose genetics. It's all predetermined for me. And this place is massive for them. It's a sanctuary in itself. <laughs> Inhale the smoke. Mm. I mean, area. Yeah, look at that. They're, they're perfectly fine. And they don't have, like, a max population. Like, they love having millions. They love sleepovers. You don't have eyebrows. Oh, no, you do. It's just you've bleached them. Uh, do we just drop one overraptor in? <laughs> just see what happens. Because that was a deleted scene, like these two. Um, the overraptor was supposed to, like, oh, did fight the Lystrosaur. <laughs> We'll put one in there, um, and then, you know, we'll put the others in here. Apparently, some dinosaurs can have trauma, which is going to be interesting. Uh, so the first one is going to its death in the Overraptor enclosure. <laughs> Although, maybe I'll massacre the Overraptors. I don't know. All I know is that this is a mission, and we'll find out how this goes. Let's speed him up. Speed up the dumping. There you go. He's like, oh, no. <laughs> Many of these dinosaurs are naturally aggressive especially the predators. We don't encourage this aggression unless we can study it, that is. Yes, for science? Oh, there you go. There's the Dominion one running around. So apparently as well, another thing is that the notification system has been updated so that now no longer will it be like a fight has begun and it's pretty much halfway through. Um, you should get notified a lot earlier so you will see them. So have 100 guests in your park and increase your park rating to 1.1... 1 .1, oh, oh, sorry, 2.5 stars. All right. Well, I'm going to sort of leave this and hopefully... Hopefully they'll have a fight. I don't think he's going to break out. Mr. Eyebrows? Yes. Oh, wow. Ooh, this one looks cool. I like this. I like the shape of it as well. We'll have this. We'll have the Lystrosaur Spa Hotel. Although we do need power. Uh... Oh. Backup generator, right, we mm, we kind of want a power supply here, so we're going to have to research some of this. This is only going to take five, so those two will do it. So can we make these decorations? I'm assuming so. Contracts have been refreshed. Yeah, I know. It's like, you still haven't done it yet. Are you stupid? Yes. <laughs> oh, there it is. No power, but still. Oh, look at it. We spy on you in your hotel. <laughs> no stairs to get out of the pool, but hey -o. And of course, this is a new skin as well, just for Malta. Gotcha. So we should now be able to make a power station. Yes. Oh my God, it's mahusive. I think, yeah, this, pretty much this whole place is just designed to be, yeah, this is what you do. Okie dokie. Unreliable information. You know, we're going to put them in. We'll find out. What? <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Shake it around. It'll not know which way's up. Right. Okay. Do you get on with things? Uh, oh, you like sticky Moloch. Oh, that's good. Um, and everything you want is here. Can we get a? Oh, I'm just amazing. How is our profit margins? Are we good? Yes. Park profitability. Overaptor has got an undiagnosed ailment. Is it head falling off because it's been in a battle? Then I don't care. Right, so we've still got a pen that has nothing in it. I don't understand this deliver to cargo ship. Four Kendra sauce. One, two, three, four. And we I like how you get a cutscene to get to see your dinosaurs get flown in. <laughs> it's just a shame they get jiggled about. Here's your dinosaur. You want to see it break all its bones? Woo! <laughs> right, okay. Well, we're definitely going to need to give you a lot of stuff. Oh, I like that bell sound. Where's that coming from? Is that the main entrance? The bell tolls! And still, my friggin' Lystrosaur has not been attacked in here. This is so weird. Did they actually get on? No, they don't like Overwrapped. I didn't think so. Carnivores and 
Therizinus. Oh my god, does Therizinosaurus have an im <gasps> I bet you it has animation where it just goes boom. <laughs> Look at that. Do we have to have a helicopter to transport this thing? Can we not just put it in the back of a van or something? <laughs> this seems to be very unecologically friendly to use all this fuel for a little thing like this. I just had an interesting message from my agency contacts. Mine as well. We're being monitored. <gasps> they want to know how we're doing managing the dinosaurs. They also have information they're willing to share. But we need them to trust us first, <gasps> right? Of course. Trust? That's a two-way street. Let's hope they see it that way. Hey, if we're uh, talking about trust, I'm your guy. It's the foundation of capitalism. <laughs> Look at it this way. <laughs> if I sell you something, you trust Ooh. that it has value. Even if something goes wrong, like, uh, say if it breaks into... <laughs> You get the Cabot Finch Guarantee. Oh, yeah? And what is that? Well, you own both halves, hmm? <laughs> yeah, that, uh, that perfectly noble word, behavior. Location we can access. <laughs> We're checking out if you ask me. Off the beaten path, but not entirely secret. This whole thing, you know, paleo curation, has been shrouded in secrecy from the get-go. It's all need to know. Well, what I do know is, it's full of surprises. Uh, that's what scares me. Well, th that and the raptors, and the T-Rex, and the Carnotaurus. <laughs> Basically, anything with teeth and claws and leathery skin. Right, okay, so use island navigation to go to San Marie! Bam, ba -dam, bam, ba -dam. Take a dinosaur off the island is the worst idea in the long, sad history of bad ideas. And I'm going to be there when you learn that. Well, I mean, Dominion was like, eh, this whatever. This location <laughs> is perfect, don't you think? Ooh. And what's more, it looks pretty secure. These Mediterranean islands have natural barriers, so we can keep the dinosaurs in and the things we don't want out. I love it. <laughs> now, we spent this whole time trying to get away from islands, and then we're back on islands tiles, again. <laughs> but you don't have to worry here. Because you see that body of water over there? Yeah? That's for us to use. <laughs> well, for the reptiles, I mean. <laughs> what? Well, I'll leave you to it. I think Dr. Du is already in waiting. Sounds like a very bad idea. <laughs> but what do I know? They released the, the Mosasaur into the ocean and nothing happened. <laughs> We're going to continue to need animals. And acquiring them through the exchange Morris remains our best choice at the moment. Morris Intrepidus. Oh, yes! A new dinosaur! Ooh. I guess we put them all in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait. Did I just put them in an enclosure with other things? Oh, I did! Oh, this is gonna be brilliant! Yes! Was there any other alternatives? No! Brilliant! Okay, we have all new animals. Lock them up and stock them up. Hold on. You're not serious. I think what Cabot means is that we want them in suitable enclosures and environments. See? Uh, the doc got it. Uh, Mr. Lambert, are you able to lend a hand? I'm here as needed. Just point me in the right direction. Where are you? I can't see you. This is as low as I can get with the photo mode. That is so... You, are, you guys are tiny. Oh, my God. Wow. Mm -hmm. Like a tiny little baby chiplet. Hopefully you get on with the T-Rex or something. Pretend you're like the T-Rex's babies. Make sure the dinosaurs have an average comfort of 90%. Well, we'll see if they get on with the Nozutoceratops. Oh, they do! Oh, okay, thank God. <laughs> sand. You want sand? You're in a world of sand. Why do you want more? I think you're probably going to find hey, enough sand. I've heard a lot about you. So here's a little about me. I'm Isaac Clement, but just call me Isaac. No need for formalities. Besides, in the park, we've got to watch each other's backs. Now, people think we're in the dinosaur game, but the truth is, we're entertainers. And our headliners traveled 65 million years to make the show. So let's make it a good one. I was going to say, didn't you, you... You said this last time, I'm pretty sure. We are learning so much about properly caring for the dinosaurs. The more comfortable we make them, the more content they are being under our care. That's a plus for both of us. Ooh, look at you! Oh, I love the patterns on the face. 
Oh, ooh, we get to see his eating animation. Yes. <laughs> Just dives head, head first. Oh, what you got there, buddy? Nom, 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 nom. Now, hopefully, the Nazuda Ceratops is... Oh, no, that, now they're not happy because they want more ground... Oh, they've got no ground leaf. What the heck? Is the game trying to trick me? While we are looking after the dinosaurs, we also want to give others a chance to see them, too. A truck, too? A In that answer. tiny thing? You understand tourism and travel. Ooh. Right, Kayla? <laughs> oh, this is tiny, this I place. I just transport them. The tourism Damn. of it all, that's all you. It's a balance. We find ourselves exploiting the animals, of course. But doing so provides funds for research, which in turn, well, benefits the animals. Sure. That's one way of looking at it. And the more the general public sees the dinosaurs, the better it is for them. So let's try increasing our dinosaur visibility, and we can take it from there. Guys, I've got it. You know what the best thing to do here is? Make a huge enclosure, and then just like, you know, partition it. So this. Oh. oh, yes. Oh, this is great. Oh, this is what I want to see. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. It's so deep as well. Finally. Oh, there's different things. Okay, this is brilliant. This is it. This is where you got to go. Instead of having that, like, depth that's all the same, does it even get shallower? Uh, oh, I don't know about it getting shallower, but it is 100% very deep. And that's the new lagoon hatchery there. So how far does this go out? Okay, so it goes out to about there. But it looks to me like it gets deeper. And look, you can be at a point near the surface where you can barely see the ocean floor. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, it does get shallower. That's awesome. Damn. Okay, oh, is there any way to get like aquatic creatures in this? If I go on dinosaurs... Oh my god, it's all carnivores. Okay. All right, so we're going to start off, you know, just just a little bit. We'll just go around here, come in through there. So I can think of nothing more appropriate than adding some marine reptiles. The exchange should have what we need. Yeah, they have them. They've also got some pretty huge tanks down there. Sure seems like they have everything. Good. Let's get it done. They'll just release them into the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> they could have at least put a net to make it look like they can't just roam free. But apparently we really not. Into the deep end with these water dinosaurs, haven't we? Technically, they're, they're not dino. Oh, God, no, uh, don't say that. Swim with them. <laughs> We're Woo! taken. Our objective is to get them comfortable and to keep them contained. At least these animals are restricted to the water, aren't they? Just stay on land and you'll be fine. <laughs> I don't think they're that's restricted just th before. that's there. <laughs> they, they're gone by. Increase the park rating to very high. Now, this is going to be quite hard just because of the way this this is. Because every like this is going to be the most demanded thing in the history of the world. So it's going to need a lot of things near it. Oh, OK. So we actually do get to view from the stand. So lower stand. Yeah. <laughs> What will we get to see? Oh, wow. The visibility is beautiful. Why do places like the ocean have stuff like this? This looks awesome. I can't really see anything at all, though. Okay, we are now running dangerous low on funds because I realized even though I moved, the, uh, the tour all the way over here made all these things. Um, I don't think the tour itself has hit the dinosaurs yet. Find a loan shark. Set cash balance to 7.5. Ticket price is 0.7 times for 10 minutes. I could, I just get 7.5 minutes and there's gonna be no qualms and I also get plus for my underground. Heck yeah! <laughs> oh my oh God, that took so long. Right, I think I've got it sorted. We've got everything, we've got power. I've changed the way the route is. I've made it look a little bit more aesthetic, you know? So we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Once we get from here, we need to increase your park rating, so we need to get more dinosaurs. But this was the big thing. In fact, one of my dinosaurs has an ailment. What? Do I even have a... Oh, I do have a mobile unit. Oh, that's good. Yeah, go find out what that is. Also, apparently, I've never assigned you to... Oh, you have. Okay, you're just taking a sweet time. Okay, dear. So here we go. I really don't like the aesthetic that they've randomly decided. Yeah, that's what... Seating with plants. That's way better. Rain in Spain? What is this? Oh, what you got? Oh, you've also got cryptid spondylitis. All right, let's go buy some dinosaurs. 
What have we got? We got a Panasaurus, Baryonyx. Something locked requires 35 authorities. That looks like a Ceratosaur, though. A Lasmosaur. Find a lot of these creatures don't get on. I'll have to find out what Ichthyosaur gets on with. Maybe... No, I don't, I don't think it gets on with Plesiosaur. But we need to buy something that gives us credit for this. So Deinonychus would be a good one. But I like the item 6 mini. me They'd be easy to take care of, I suppose. Unreal about my team and I went to great lengths to pr procure these beasts. Hence the high price. I bet you did. And we're going to buy them all now. This can be the Dilophosaurus exhibit right here. Yeah, it's bringing the beasties in. However, I need to kind of cordon these guys off just first. Because then we can have the tour go through the different exhibits. And that way we'll make them utilize the, the most amount of the space. And they've already got problems. Ah, fantastic. I don't even know which one it is. Now, you might want more once the rest of you start coming in. Oh, oh Dilophosaurus looks good. It looks so good with this terrain. Everybody loves Minmi. 318 stars. As opposed to 900. Ah, who cares? It costs me a million. Ah, put them all in. Yes. So now I just need to increase your park rating to two stars. And the only way to do that, really... Oh, we got a fractured leg. Injured ingrown claw. It'll never recover. No. You got a dinosaur running free on the island. What? Uh, stay on land and you'll be fine. Didn't you say, doctor? Hmm? Huh? The one thing you can always expect is, well, the unexpected. We can contain it. We expect and plan for every contingency. Okay, great. <laughs> so, uh, nobody should panic. Uh, unless you have a room for that sort of thing, which I do, and I kind of wish I was in right now. <laughs> right, and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna make up the route here. We'll probably delete it later. There we go, put all the way down here. And regain the control. Wow. <laughs> now to put everything back together. You want to know who I am? No. For now, that question shall remain unanswered. Your name's right there, Sayona. I'd love to be trustworthy. <laughs> and the circumstances may well change. Surely you could put question mark, question mark, question mark. What you need to know right now is that I can introduce you to dealers you won't meet anywhere else. Um, and let me assure you, mm. the specimens being sold by the underground are a cut above the rest. Fabulous. These people represent a different side to the exchange, quite unlike the one you're accustomed to. But the discovery of choice and opportunity often go hand in hand. Okay. It looks like you've already got your work cut out for you here. Wait. I'll be in touch. Oh, there's the card of if you survive this ordeal. Ah, it's fine. Look, we're right there. Hey, oh, uh, we'll take manual control over this and, uh... We've gotta contain that dinosaur ASAP. Imagine what it must oh. be doing to the people it's chasing in the facility. Uh, I'd rather not. It's hey, fine, can't you deal with this, Clement? It is the reason you're here. <laughs> I thought it was because you like... Oh, yeah, it's lovely. I can get that animal under control? <laughs> Them, I love. Is it gonna kill anybody? Murder, kill, and slave. Oh, look at that. It's the skin from uh, 2022. It's the, this one from the multipack, where it's got the uh, only one horn. <laughs> you were supposed to be Toro. Ah, bless. Fortunately, there's nobody around, but we will need somewhere to put it. Am I right in thinking that we're going to sell this animal to the exchange? That's the plan. Okay. We can get it off the books and out of our hair, not to mention turning a nice bit of profit. It's just a bonus the Cabot will definitely appreciate. I mean, we need to, apparently. So, yeah, let's, let's, sure, let's go for it. Plus 10 to that. Heck yeah, yeah. and monies. Make sure you're getting the maximum value you can for them. No sense leaving money on the table. Oh, okay. Uh, we need to purchase five Demorphodon. Oh. I don't know what it is about these flyers. They just, they make me nervous. <laughs> okay. Well, they ruled the air long before you did, Kayla. Ah. I thought you'd welcome the competition. Mm -mm. They stay in their part of the sky. I stay in mine. Right, Unless okay. Yes. You'd like to come with? You offering to be my co-pilot, Finch? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, I'll keep my feet right where they belong. On my desk. You won't get tornadoes here, surely. We'll be fine. And things are already damaged. It's brilliant. Multiple dinosaurs are about to escape. Well, actually. No, they're not, because what we're going to do is we're going to delete that, and therefore there's no gate for them to escape from, and then we replace it, so... <laughs> and there's no escape. And what's going on over here? Easy to fix? I don't know. Delete it. 
Yes, then add another one. Brilliant. <laughs> oh, look at you basking in glorious sunshine. Sauropods, onlopamimids, hydrosaurs, and pachycephalosaurids. Okay, uh, I thought it said you, you don't like cryptids. No, cer ceratopsids. Maybe they'd be okay in this one if I just extended it a little bit. Yeah, we'll, we'll transfer them over to the other enclosure. Okay, so it's, it's actually in between. Oh, I see how it's supposed to go now. Ah, get you. All right, that'll do. Avery, oh, oh, of course, now I have an issue. Proceed as normal with construction. An archaeological discovery has been found during the construction. Uh, do we gain authority points? Or do we gain... Uh, yeah, let's gain that. We gain money and it sort of kind of maybe balances it out. Eh, whatever. Don't think we can put anything in it right now. There we go. Okay, so we've got that operational. We can now go into here. We can buy said Dermorphodons at the top. Buy now. And put in. Here they come. The tiniest things in the world. With their new Malta skin. It's like a weird little vampire bat, isn't it? So far, the flying reptiles seem to be doing okay. You say that? Nice. Let's make sure they have a solid comfort rating. <laughs> then, we'll see if they're ready to meet the puppy. Oh, there you go. Oh, and uh, an ailment? <laughs> Why can't they come in trucks or something? I know, I know, but stay with me. How about we make the flyers part of a new tour, huh? I mean, come on. I've even got the sales pitch. Come watch prehistoric reptiles take flight. <laughs> For a small fee, of course. I like it. I'd expect nothing less. It'll be a challenge, but the reward should be worth the risk. These animals need a place to spread their wings in a safe and controlled space. And I'd expect nothing less. Damn. <laughs> I thought, that'll be enough space, right? Uh, no, we need to move this. I don't even know where, but it needs moving. Infected wound. How would you research it? Eh, just make sure it doesn't fight for a while. And there you go. That's how you research that. Oh, finally! Kedrosaur is fine. Oh, wait, do they these guys not get on? Kedrosaur's and Stigma. Ah, it's fine. <laughs> right, you need more victories. You know who I am. I do. Sure. Soyona Santos. You were in that you movie were once. You of a legend in the underground. <laughs> <laughs> Am I? Um, <laughs> what? You mean you don't know? Of course I do. And I've worked hard to achieve that status. Doing questionable things. I've never questioned them. I commit to what I believe. That means I live and operate in the shadows. The grey between the light and the dark. Mm. Okay. Whatever helps you sleep. What do you want, Sayona? Edgelord! We can help each other. And the dinosaurs. But first, I must be convinced I can trust you. She's going to want How my rating higher, isn't she? And why would I want to? Oh, no, no. Don't question. Commit. Commit! Commit! <laughs> oh, wait. Oops. I didn't realize that was going to end the thing. What's all this information I'm getting about a whole undiscovered island? Look, the underground always keeps things under wraps. Hey! Got it. Hey! Like you got a new friend. <laughs> friend? No, 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 no. Well, uh, how about business associate, huh? Yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> Couldn't be. Oh, I don't know. Soyona Santos. La, la, la. I can't hear you, Kayla. Okay. Maybe it is. <laughs> I knew it. If there's an angle to exploit, there. Wait, are you drinking from water? There's no water there, mate. What are you doing? Limit increased. Oh, so there was a limit. Right, okay. Well, we're going to take Kyla's plane, apparently. Going to site XYZ. Let's go to Grech. All right. Oh, look at you. This is the perfect place. Away from prying eyes. Well, so you say. In particular, those of your CIA friends. <laughs> I mean, it's an friends. island. How could it be I away? Don't have any Easy friends. to see. I can vouch for that. Not ouch. inconspicuous. Yeah, to be fair, she's not wrong, but uh, still, <laughs> ouch. All right, let's put feelings aside. Cool. What's your plan for this island, Finch? Well, first things first, my team are going to need to get the existing facilities back in working order. And then I think a little visit to the exchange would come in handy. You will honor our agreement, Mr. Finch. If we are to have an arrangement, it must be one that's mutually beneficial, or 
Or what? Death. Or there will be problems and the dinosaurs will become the least of your worries. I'll murder your family. I'll murder, murder, I'll murder everybody. <laughs> okay. Right, so this is the third island. Sweet. Right, let's... Oh, it's disabled. Is it everything I promised? You didn't Look. promise a thing. Then I've kept my word, Mr. Finch. I'm expecting you to keep yours. Ah, it's too loud. <laughs> Relationships and disappointment. <laughs> That's never been an issue with me before. I hope you're more competent at your job than you are at lying. I am, thank you. Uh, huh. I think. I was actually just about to sign off on a handful of building repairs, so <laughs> yeah, I can't afford to hang around, I'm afraid. Oh, isn't that a shame? Yes, it is. Okay, right, now I can get in. So I think I did a... Uh, <laughs> I should have been able to do that there. <laughs> Before it gave me control, I was like, fix! And the game was like, oh, okay, but you you shouldn't have been able to do that. <laughs> right, I think that's everything, right? The hatchery, the gate, uh, and acquisition center, I think. Oh, so let's have a look at this map. So, oh yeah, this is the biggest one. This is, this is the one you're probably most likely... Uh, going to want to play on. There's no, um, what do you call it? There's no lagoon area, which is a bit of a shame. Only one of those islands have it. But if you're playing on this, you basically get, I'm assuming in Sandbox, to do all three? I don't know. We'll find out how that works. Acquisition center. What, do I need that? Beautiful, yes. As a result of your recent actions, some of the sellers in the exchange are now willing to do business with you. Ooh. Primarily those that deal in dinosaur eggs. And I'm guessing that comes at a price? Nothing in life is free, Finch. You, if anyone, should know that. Well, I figured that out a long time ago. Ah! I don't have the money! All the skills! Would anyone care to give me a report? <gasps> Dodson? Lewis Dodson! Biosyn has an interest here? Oh, Biosyn has an interest in everything. You think these back alley traders could set something like this up without help? I've been monitoring things, of course. Biosyn realizes that effective, meaningful dinosaur research is more than science. It's information and art. All of those disciplines require funds, which I'm fortunate enough to have in abundance. Uh, this could get awkward. For who? You? As far as Soyona Santos goes, I have her trust. Mostly earned through cold hard cash. But when it comes to our cooperation with you, know that my interest, Biosyn's interest, is only in information. Nothing more. Well, truth is, I... I'm already not supposed to know about the island, so this complicates things. Then let me make it easy for you. We need to incubate these eggs we've acquired and get them into circulation. And by circulation, you mean enclosures, correct? Oh, Cabot. Uh, it's not complicated. I love how, like, when what was it? When Dawson comes in, it's just be like, Oh, I'm bringing Dawson! <laughs> oh, God. This doesn't have the gravitas of, like, a, a Jeff Goldblum, unfortunately. Really. Anyway, anyway, let's go release them into the, the, the market. I don't know. Do we want to then? Is that all we're doing? Oh, yes. Look at them. Glorious new Allosaur skins. It's the miracle of life. Isn't that what this entire endeavor with the dinosaurs? Isn't that what this is all about? For you, it is. For me, these animals are just another commodity. And that makes me sad for you. These animals, Soyona, are wonders of nature. That I bring to you. Ooh. Yes, yes you do. Fire! But now, I require something else. Genomes. That can be arranged. The exchange will have just what you're looking for. Alright, we should be able to do... Yes. Oh, can we modify? <gasps> oh, that's this not what I want. This is important to my research. Yes! Three steps stand between us and a new genome. Oh, ghost! Incubate, release. What nature does in millions of years, we can do in mere hours. This is the new evolution. This is Biosyn. 
Oh, so this is supposed to have taken place before Biosyn was a thing. Ah, okay. Or at least before the events of Dominion, I assume. So, are we are we wanting to release these guys, like, together? Or oh, what, what's the plan here, really? Because these guys are going to break out before you know it. Because they, they are going to be not happy. So, it wants four of these buggers. All right, well, there you go. Uh, oh, oh. Oh, it's gonna be done in 19 seconds. What a boss! Have another game. Yes, this is. Oh, this is bringing back memories of when I did that Jurassic difficulty playthrough. Good God! All right, let's release the Atrociraptors. Look at the claw! The claw! They're all the same. Ooh, that's cool. The loyalest of things. The complete successful genomes of, like, or testing Kayla, of Indoraptor. I understand correctly, you are somewhat of a transportation expert, hmm? Thanks for noticing. <laughs> One of my better talents, and I do have many. Mm hmm. Like asking for favors. <laughs> do I do that? Maybe I'm just in tune with who's capable of doing what. For example, I need you to oversee the next fa Oh my god, they're attacking the Alasaur! ...phase of this island's operation. And what exactly does that involve? Well, we've got a cargo ship to move the dinosaurs between the islands. I could use your supervision. I'll see what I can do. Oh, they killed it. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Whoopsie daisies! The Alasaur is, is, it came down with a serious case of deadness. All right, let's get all these ghosts in. The movie would have been very different if I was in control. <laughs> increase your park rate. Oh, wait, what? I've got to increase a park rating? Oh, urgent message. What? I was just buying dinosaurs. Sponsorship opportunity. Commit to giving the dinosaur a good life, the Diplodocus. I mean, I will commit. Yeah. I mean, I was going to do that anyway. <laughs> okay. So we've got four Retrociraptors that are very good. Stop! Confirm selection. Stop! Okay, so we can now put these in here. Stop! <laughs> ah, the perfect T-Posesaurus. So, I mean, whenever you want to see what a dinosaur looks like in its T-Pose, bring it from the cargo ship and pause the game instantly. That's how you'll know how to do it. Ah! Mission failed. Hold dinosaurs in the cargo ship. <laughs> Apparently, I wasn't supposed to move the Atrociraptors out. That was a mission. Okay. All right, so we've moved the Allosaurs into this enclosure now, which is definitely not good for them. And I can no longer check on what they need. But if I remember correctly, it was definitely to praise. And it would 100% be some water. And we've got... Oh, apparently these monolophosauruses are very not good. So let's have a look. They want a little bit more forest than the Allosaur had. Uh, they want meat. So actually I could have saved money by not... Uh, just by moving those instead of making new ones because I feel like this is going to cost a fortune. Oh, 100,000. Yeah! Actually, that's okay. Okay, we are back. And I've had to... Well, I don't even know where we left off. We've got a fight here going on. I'm not exactly sure why. Population's fine. You know, they just like to have a little bit of a, of a fight with each other. Also, uh, for some odd reason, this has not been checked up on. Or at least it's... Uh, Ah, uh, I think we need to check on those because apparently they haven't broken out yet, which is great because they probably would have before now. But I have now sort of redone this. So we've got a vet building now, which means that we can actually go and investigate uh, or treat our dinosaurs and see what's the issue. Uh, we've also got a tour vehicle uh, program up going up, but we haven't really sorted out this area just yet. Um, we just need to see... Uh, how these Allosaurs are doing. If I remember correctly, I tried to do or give them the best that I could. And you, you know what? They were like a tiny bit off being 100% happy. They just wanted like a little bit more forest. And apart from that, they're all good. We have chosen a different um, objective now, which is basically just take pictures of dinosaurs. So we're going to get like a cool $60,000 from this, I think. Oh, yes, at the watering hole. So we get 38,000 for doing it. Uh, photograph a dinosaur drinking. Oh, okay. Uh, never mind. Uh, give me a second. There he is. Is he? Is that drinking? Correct. Yeah, beautiful. Sweet. And 300,000 on top of that. And we're making our money. But while we're here, I just want to get a good look at the Allosaur skin, you know, in the daylight. Like, look at that. Oh, it's gorgeous. Yes. <laughs> Beautiful skin up, but I'm glad we finally got it. 
All right, so that's another enclosure put in here. And this is probably where we'll have a look to see what's left in the cargo. I feel like we... Okay, do not take out the Atrociraptors. Apparently, that will kill the game. We don't want any of that. But we do have a bunch of other stuff. I think the Draco Rex, the Allura Titan, and possibly the Nezudo Ceratops should all go together. And actually, that is huge. Delivery cost is 140,000. thousand. Yeah, this might need to be a way bigger enclosure. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect it to be that big. Well, okay, well, yeah. Um, let me just do, do two seconds. Let's make this a little bit bigger. Look at all you. Oh, God, they're doing the cute animation. That is what we call Nikki Gill. We're, we're making even less profit now. I don't even know how that's imaginable, but we're doing it. We're fight. Life finds a way, and we're. Boy, howdy, we're doing it. Alrighty, let's get to work on making this an inhabitable exhibit for them. Alright, that's the Allura Titan happy. You don't know how to medicate things, so I'll show you. There it is, see? Not that hard now, is it? Boom. Boom. Yeah. Oh, oh, he took a bullet for you. If you have a wedding, mate, he should be a best man. He will literally take a bullet for you. Although it's healing medication, so maybe it's the opposite. <laughs> All right, I finally got enough money. I'm going to incubate my Atrociraptors. I know that was a mission from ages ago, but now we're not making a minus profit. Well, so bad. It was like 12, 17,000, some ridiculous. Now we're only making... Minus 900. Oh, there's the minus 4,000. Well, we'll get there eventually. You know, it, it, it's the thought that counts. <laughs> Strew the Mimus, I will airlift you and put you in here. Because this is basically a huge safari zone for all the herbivores. And Atrociraptor is almost done as well. And unfortunately, I'm not going to... I mean, we'll see the release animation in, like, showcases and stuff like that. But for now, we'll just release it via airlift because it's a lot easier. All right, time for the Atrociraptors. Oh, please don't put these Atros... These are different Atrociraptors. Don't put these ones down after putting all this work and go, mission failed. Yes! Oh, and this is the regular skin. Yeah, it's not even a movie accurate one. These ones are random. Uh, is there anything else he needs? It's just forest. That's literally probably more forest. Yes. Good thing about this forest is that it's, it's not too busy. Unless there's loads of, like, space, like there is over here. But really, this is a huge map. Left to have a see how this one goes. I can't wait. We gotta do like the Raptor Squad against the Atrociraptor Squad. Are they actually gonna fight? Ooh, lovely jubbly. You know what it is? Without the skins, they kind of just look like beefed up Velociraptors. <laughs> right, we are starting to increase profit now. That's good. We're making money. Are you? Oh. Are you red as well? What are the chances of getting two reds? I bet you are as well, aren't you? And the final one is just a regular looking one. But no, oh, no. Well, you know what? It looks quite nice. I like the purple. It's like a lollipop. Oh, Kayla did I do it? me that the dinosaurs are all on board. <laughs> the ship is ready to sail. Good. What ship? I've been impressed by what I've seen so far, Captain. But tell me. Can I trust you to deliver? Yeah. We made a deal, <laughs> and our intention is to see it through. <laughs> Excellent. Just don't ever betray my trust. That would not be ideal for you. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> what? <laughs> so many Just threats. Just follow through. Disappointment and I do not get along well. I don't plan on disappointing you. Then we'll get along famously. But remember... I don't know you. <laughs> yeah, what matters is that Not you know yet. me. Oh, God, what just happened? Why did the fence... Oh, the Nezudoceratops are not happy because they need more forest. Oh, fantastic. Oh, well, anyway, we need to go to San, San Alberta, so... <laughs> Bye! I'll leave you to sort out that. Business must be strong for you right now. People quickly come to learn that I can provide things that others cannot. Whether a suited corporate pawn likes dealing with the underground, well, that's another matter. Uh, of course, the inimitable Cabot Finch. I believe he and his team know where they stand with me now. Likewise. I hope for their sakes they're gaining the complete trust of their contacts. As things stand, I'm not entirely sure I know where their allegiance lies. Both! Only time will tell. But the fact that they've headed back to this island tells me they have unfinished business here. Then I? I will no doubt be hearing from our mutual friend. 
soon. <gasps> well, friend? You'll definitely be hearing from me. Friend! <laughs> I can assure you of that. <laughs> Feels good to be back, doesn't it? No! Exactly the sentimental type. Fair enough. It just made me think back to when we first arrived on the island. I mean, seriously, all those hours look ago. How far we've come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I get it. Uh, look, I'm gonna need to go take a look at those inbound dinosaurs. Remember that cargo ship? Well, it's nearly here. Oh, uh, of course. Yeah, we, we, we'd better get some enclosures ready, hadn't we? We're talking about it's already ready. With the two going all the way through. Oh yeah. Ensure the address are comfortable in their new habitat. Oh, did I do that? I didn't even realize. Apparently they're missing stuff, but hey-ho. Hey, Kayla, huh? Reckon the facility's got that wow factor yet? <laughs> yeah, I'd say it's getting there. The new arrivals will help. Oh, for sure. It's just the incentive we need to push our park rating that little bit higher, huh? Oh my god, the full star? <laughs> Good god! Shoot for the stars! Ah, fine, we'll spend a million for freaking iguanodons, and that should push us over the edge. <laughs> I'm really struggling here. Oh, yeah, iguanodon has the new animation. Oh, not an animation, sorry. The new skin. I completely forgot about that. The deleted dinosaur from Dominion arrives. Like a weird snake thing with legs. Yes. Now you want ground fruit as well. Your area's fine. And now that should just be enough. To push us over because we're not being penalized now i think for not having enough things in the park i, I think we're good variety oh i did it i did it oh trying to find the balance between glory and freedom is something i've been chasing my whole life well figuring out how to play both sides to your advantage is the essence of business yes you are made for this line of work you know well appreciate it Guess I just need to roll with the changes. Damn. Look, this whole thing, Jurassic Park, Jurassic World, InGen, Biosyn, it's all about change. The world we were born into, <laughs> that doesn't exist anymore. We just have to adapt, hmm? Or we die out. Uh, I like my version better. Look, we're making a difference here. No! I want us to get no, all the islands up to five stars, huh? Yeah. And I want everyone on our side. <laughs> Maximum trust across the board, okay? Yeah. You really think that'll change anything? <laughs> trust me! <laughs> do I have a choice? No. <laughs> no, you do not. So, is Kyla always working for, like, the good guys? Authorities and underground trust increased. Okay. Mission complete! Dominion campaign multi- Oh, that's it! Right, okay, so... <laughs> you know what? You know what? I've recorded now for five, six, five to six hours, and we have done it. We have finally completed the campaign. What can I say about it? It's... I think it gives you a good overview, like, of what this scenario can do. There's, and there's way more as well. You keep getting the, the, the missions and stuff come through if you want to carry on with that. It sheds some light on, you know, Kayla Watts and Siona Santos and just how that works. Uh, you also get, you know, the, the cool new dinosaurs. You get to see them all pretty much. Iguanodons here, Allosaur, the Carnotaurus, uh, Lystrosaurus, Oviraptor. They're all pretty much here. And you know what? It wasn't so bad. I'm glad that we don't have to go to every island and have to make everything five stars. But at the same time, I am very glad that this is done and out of the way. I think the reason why I get the DLC isn't because of the campaign. Uh, maybe it's challenges. That's always interesting. But it's mainly for these new creatures, new maps, new skins for like pretty much a bunch of dinosaurs like the Allosaur, the Carnotaurus, um, or, you know... A Trosseraptor gets skins as well as, you know, the ones from uh, Dominion. And look at how cute these guys are. They're adorable. 
as well as, you know, they're going to have new animations with other dinosaurs like the T-Rex and stuff. You get new buildings, there's new kind of missions and stuff involved. It's a load of fun, but I am so glad it's over. Oh, thank God. If you've enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. Of course, this is one video of many that will go up today. We'll be showcasing a lot of the dinosaurs, um, a lot of... Uh, well, pretty much anything that we <laughs> every anything that's come new, anything that's new in this DLC, uh, we'll definitely showcase. But if you enjoyed it, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you kiddies later. Oh, bye bye.